Hi guys, I've got the Pixel 3 camera running on my Pixel 2. Let's go ahead and take a look and also learn how to install it. Let's go do this, baby. Hi guys, so this is the Pixel 3 camera on my Pixel 2. All right, you can go ahead and grab the APK. I'll go ahead and show you how to install it in a bit, but let me go ahead and show you what it looks like. Now you have a um, slightly different UI, uh, same HR Plus, HR Plus Enhanced. Camera processing should have improved uh, with this new camera, so definitely upgrade. And also um, there is an option for RAW and RAW Plus JPEG. Now you do have to enable that in more and settings and go to advanced. And make sure raw plus jpeg control is on so this is awesome for those of you who want to get of the best photos out of your pixel phone now you can actually get the raw photos along with the jpeg all right which is awesome also portrait mode is probably the one of the biggest uh, things that have improved so let me go ahead and do a test here here we go um so let's go ahead and take a photo here portrait mode now once you take a photo with portrait mode um, you will have an option to actually control the blur. So go into settings. Now you can go ahead and go into settings again here and you can go ahead and control the depth, which is really cool. All right, and you can go ahead and increase the depth. Now let's say you wanna change focus afterwards. You can go ahead and change the focus to the second Android or you can even change the focus to the background. All right, it seems like you can only change it to um, only the foreground objects here. All right, but that's still really cool that you could do this after. Um, this is coming really handy. For example, you were trying to focus on this guy, but your camera focus there. Then you can go ahead and save it like that. Uh, but let me go ahead and set it back here and go back here. And there is a option for color pop, which works quite well. And let me go ahead and show you how well this works. All right, you can go ahead and remove it or add it. You can see it grays out everything there. So that's really cool, all right? Um, also, you have some different modes here that you can play with. All right, so really cool stuff. Now you can also go ahead and uh, mess with all the dials, highlights, shadows, which is really nice. Um, and also color, you can go ahead and change the saturation, warmth. Um, skin tone, I'll go ahead and show you this. This works really well for the front camera. And yeah, awesome interface here. So if you have a Pixel 2 or Pixel 2 XL, you're gonna be able to get all of the Pixel 3 portrait new features. So definitely check it out. Now let me go ahead and demonstrate the front um, camera real quick. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take a photo for you guys. Check this out. All right, so I take the portrait mode and let's go ahead and take a look. And looks very, very good. Now, processing should have improved. The edges should be a lot better also. Um, looks not bad, right? Now you can go ahead and change the blur, all right, to the depth. And you can make it um, so you can see the background or you can add more blur, which is awesome. If you wanna add more saturation, and look at that, all right, that looks really good. It doesn't look too saturated as colors without making it um, too unnatural. So I really like this. Of course, if your exposure was wrong, you can also play with the dials here, all right? I'm gonna make, actually make it a slightly brighter, all right? Also, you can go ahead and make the color pop if you want. Um, all the rest of the stuff I showed you earlier. Let's try Metro, Eiffel, uh, Blush, uh, Modena, Real, Vogue, Real, all right? Um, bizarre. I'm gonna, I actually like this bizarre. Wow, that looks really, really awesome. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and hit save. And yeah, look at that. That is awesome. Um, so right now you can get this. This is actually just a straight Pixel 3 camera APK. And yeah, there's also new panorama mode, uh, which allows you to stitch more easily. So you can go ahead and like that and just simply move. All right, and it will show you a little dial here and um, it'll make a portrait. Now, I'll go ahead and show you the one I made earlier, and this will actually give you a VR mode. So check this out, all right? So now you can view your portrait mode. This is uh, one I just took at sunset in my backyard. All right, so sort of a VR look to the portrait mode. Sorry, um, a panorama mode, sorry. All right, also there is um, Google Lens of slow motion, uh, AR stickers. Other than that, the new cool feature um, is uh, from the Pixel 3, is that for example, let's say I took a photo of something with some information. All right, let's say I took a photo of that. 
which I'll have a review of by the way. Now let's say I wanted to grab this um, www.cablematters.com and I can go ahead and simply hit this button Google Lens and it will actually find it for you, right? How cool is that, right? It finds all the things in your photo and especially stuff like a website, telephone number. Um, so you're gonna be able to easily get stuff off your photos without actually typing it down or writing it down. So that's really cool. The only thing missing is obviously um, some of the newer stuff from the Pixel 3, uh, such as the new Top Shot, a live lens, and a few other things. And also you have a new um, zoom dial, which is all, a lot easier to use, which is sort of nice. All right, nice little feature. Other than that, you can go ahead and install this. Highly recommend it if you have a Pixel 2 or Pixel uh, phone. Let me go ahead and show you how to install it. Now, to install this, make sure you have Android 9.0 Pi. For those of you who know, know what that is, go into settings, go into system, uh, go into about phone, and you should see Android version 9. If you don't have Android 9, you're not gonna be able to install this. Um, if you didn't update your phone, go ahead and update it to Android 9.0 Pi first. Next, go ahead and go to apkquick.com and find the Pixel 3 Google Camera APK for Pixel, Pixel XL, Pixel 2, Pixel 2 XL. I have direct link to this site. If you go here and browse, go to the bottom, download Pixel 3 Google Camera APK. Um, go ahead and click on the link. I'll have the direct link to this in the description below or in my tutorial, so go check it out. I'm um, go ahead and go all the way down to the bottom where it says click here to download. Don't click on the ads. Um, go here, click here to download. And if you have trouble downloading, go ahead and try long click and do open an incognito tab. All right, that will download the file, hit OK. All right, once downloaded, um, you're gonna go ahead and install it and you will have Pixel 3 camera on your Pixel or Pixel 2. Now, it should also work on Nexus 6P if you're running custom ROM on Android 9.0. I'm actually in the process of trying it. It should work on most of the Google devices. Um, also may work on other Android devices, but I have not tried it yet. Um, you may have to wait for a port. All right, once downloaded, click here and you may have to check unknown sources on. Um, go ahead and do that, install and boom shakalaka. You will have the new Pixel 3 camera on your Pixel phone. And look at that, it is beautiful. Now this is the original Pixel XL. On Pixel and Pixel XL, you're not gonna get the new portrait mode. Um, you'll have to have a Pixel 2 for now. Later people will release a modded version where you can also use it but you'll have to wait for that. But otherwise you should be able to get all the other features um, such as the panorama and your photos should have improved. So with the original Pixel, you will also be able to get now get uh, raw photos, which is awesome. All right, so definitely check it out. And this is a quick HDR photo I took. Your photo processing should have improved. I don't see why you would not want to install this. And thank you guys for watching this video. Hit the thumbs up for me. Have a great day. And as always, stay <laughs> on Pixel. Subscribe.